he look okay? What is he doing? Should I go talk to him? Cover him with the umbrella, make him feel good. Oh yeah, he's, he's getting all wet. Yeah, here, I'll just, I'll just, I'll come up in a second. Hey, what's uh, what up, Melvin? What you, what you Bro, doing? I want to experience the Spy Ninja headquarters today. It's not open yet, bro. Yeah, it opens soon, right? We'll, we'll all get like a, a ticket or Dude, something. Dude, it looks so hype. There's VR, there's axe throwing, there's arcade rooms. Well, that's there's cool. There's escape rooms, trampolines, and food and drink, bro. I mean, you're just standing out here in the rain. It's yeah, kind of heavy looking. Are you okay? Are you, uh, I will wait here till it opens. It's opening soon, but not that soon. You're gonna get all wet, boy. Well, it will open soon. You're right about that. But I have an idea so we can experience the Spy Ninja headquarters today. It doesn't involve breaking, breaking. Oh in there. no, okay. no, oh. no, no breaking and entering. Okay, okay. all right, cool. Well, then I, I like that. I all like right, that. let's all head back to the Mobile Command Center so we can experience the Spy Ninja headquarters today. Yeah. We're here at the Las Vegas <laughs> Circus Center. He's got no pulse. We're here for the trampolines, because that's one of the big selling points of the headquarters. Uh oh, I can't Hello? see. Scary, Melvin. What are you scared? Are you scared or something? Not, oh, scared. Oh, are you scared? How about I tell you about one of the times I was most scared when I was in the Spy Ninjas. Oh, okay, I guess you can make up for not doing a trick by I'm sharing I'll, a story. I have more tricks than all you guys. Tell us then, tell us. Okay. Mel, tell, Mel, tell. Mel, tell. Well, <laughs> it was actually the last time I was here. I came here with Chad and V. Oh my gosh, that's so sick. Oh my gosh. Well, we were pretty much here jumping on the trampolines and he tried to make a jump from one trampoline to another doing a backflip. But he made a mistake once. He like cut his rotation and then just landed square flat on his back on the divider in between the trampolines, which, oh, which is like this? padded, but it's like still like a bunch of springs and steel bar in the middle. But he was done jumping and then we were just like, holy crap. And this was before he had any signs of any back issues, or at least not to oh, us. Dang, that's a scary story, that's bro. Scary. Yeah, and I was there to witness that. I was like, oh my gosh. Made me even more fearful of backflips. I'll do all the spinning tricks in the world, but I won't do a backflip. Well, you know what? I've never done a backflip in my what? life. What? I'm gonna do one today. Are I think. You serious? That's I think. dangerous. Why don't you just do my trick? You show your belly. I need to conquer a fear today. Try to yeah, that's a, that's a good one, that's right? Oh. <laughs> You're flipping backwards. What does it look like? Zero to ten. Okay. I can give it a modest seven. This is it no matter what, unless it isn't. Yo, clean! You're a trampoliner. Okay, fear conquered. But I'm pretty sure you got some fears that happened during our time as Spy Ninjas. Yeah, it's honestly happening right now. What? What's your fear, bro? Oh! Okay. oh. <laughs> My biggest fear when I was associated with the Spy Ninjas is being on camera. That's why I literally am saying it's happening right now. Oh. Do any of you relate? You're still scared? I mean, yeah, but I've just gotten used to it. I just eventually like forced to not pay attention. So I had a whole video to myself when I was with Project Zorgo. We broke into the that. safe house to save my sister. The boys on Project Zorgo wanted me to film the whole thing so we could make a video out of it. The boy. Chad ended up taking the footage and posting it to his channel. That a boy, Chad. I didn't expect millions of people to see me filming my own video on Chad's channel. It's scary being on camera. Do you agree? Let me know if you do. So I encourage you, if you're afraid to be on camera, you just gotta do it and force yourself yeah. through it. You care so much about what you look like on camera, nobody else cares. See, Melvin loves being on camera. It's tough for me. Do I really? I think you do. Melvin, show me some of your moves. Oh, yeah, I definitely broke my face on Dude. the thing. Yeah. Oh. 
Let's go. Let's go. Oh crap. Well, I'm trying to do something, but I can't do it. Yeah, I'm well, not really a trickster. Are you fearful though? Oh, I got fears. Why don't you share with the camera some of your fears as well? Yeah, share. One of my biggest fears in the Spy Ninjas is something that haunts me to this day. I always think about it. Even in my last video that I made at the safe house with Chad and V, I brought this moment up. It was when I had to do a face reveal and for the very first time. Remember, I used to be that blurred freak. It's easy to, you know, be on camera when you're not on camera, you know what I mean? That moment that I had my hands to cover my face and I had to show the world what I actually look like. Oh man, I just thought when this video goes live, all the comments are gonna be like, this guy is ugly or ew. But you guys, the subscribers, they were so nice. Having the courage to take my hands off my face and show the world what Daniel actually looks like. What happened? She just double backflip and got oh. caught it. Yeah. Now look at you, Daniel. You can't help but be on camera now. Uh, now I have no shame. I love putting my face out there. I'm full of myself. Make sure you subscribe to his channel. He makes the best content. Shut! Everybody, don't listen to him. Subscribe right now to the Melvin and Dane channel. Below this video, the subscribe button. Also, like this video. Let's get these guys to 187,369 subscribers. If we get 100,000 likes on this video, <laughs> I will wait outside the Spy Ninjas HQ until it opens. Oh! <laughs> yeah, well, well, the trampolines, big part of the headquarters. They have a ninja course here, too. We should just try that a little bit. Okay. Ninja Warrior Obstacle Course. HQ is going to be way better. Yes. Let's go, Dane. So hot. You made it. Yeah, yeah, dude. Whoa, that's Come on, Daniel. At a place like this, I was a crazy boy. Dude, don't crazy on me. Come on. Oh, dang it. <laughs> what a crazy boy. You can't even tell he's doing anything. Yeah, yeah what the heck. But there's plenty of things at Spy Ninja's HQ that we could still experience today. Like what? Like what? <laughs> Whoa. Ladies and gentlemen, we are at Sin City Smash for axe throwing. Because Spy Ninja's HQ also showcases that they have some axe throwing. Oh, do they? Oh, theirs is gonna be better than this. <laughs> I mean, hopefully. Well, they're probably gonna be throwing all bunch of ninja gadgets. But we're getting started with these axes. Oh, I forgot your- Oh! Gosh. Dude. Whoa, that was cool. Okay. You, you said you've done this before? Yeah, we made a video back. <laughs> Ooh. I wasn't there. I was with Chad and me and we did this in a video. But mm. HQ's gonna be awesome because you can like, you can even like chop fruit and stuff. But can you? I think it's gonna be nuts. Oh. 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 Is that a two or three? Whoa, cute. Wow. Did you hear those cracks? <laughs> yeah. That was my knees. Whoa. Four. My wood cutting level in RuneScape was ninety nine. Hey. Axe throwing. Axe. Throwing. I'm gonna ask you a question, Daniel. Nice ax. That I think the audience wants to know. Okay. Just like my amazing first axe throw, and similar to Melvin's decent axe throw. Nah, it was it was good. Tell me, tell us your most successful moment at the spy ninjas. Oh. oh. Hey, it's easier to think of the fails. I'll be honest with you. There's lots of fails. My biggest success is probably bringing Shad back to us through song. Remember that? And then, I do. I was I was new on Project Zorgo at that time. I was like, what is this song? <laughs> yeah, man, that was amazing. You know, Chad, he was, he was acting a little crazy. You gotta get him back to his normal self. Yeah. So I wrote a little song. All of us did. Melvin was in it. Regina <laughs> was in it. V was in it. I did see that. And we all sang. And you know what? 
I love music. And that video got like, it's almost at like 80 million views. Yeah, like huge. Yeah. I mean, all your music videos have done like huge, right? I mean, Chad produced a lot of them. Mm, okay. But I wrote some of the lyrics and uh, so did Chad. We all kind of wrote the lyrics, but man, I love the one we did a diss track on you. <laughs> <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> Christmas song. I'd say all the music videos. Biggest successes. That's what I'm most proud of. I appreciate that. That what sounds valid. What are you talking about? Like He's kind of just kidding. Kidding. It's a music videos. I remember when we made a rock style music yeah! video. Yeah! Oh, that's underrated. It's such an underrated song. You know, I edited that one. Yeah. You, uh, you wrote it. No, yeah! you wrote it too! Guys, you gotta go check that one out. It's underrated. It's Where so did my weird. old friend go? The chat walk I used to know. Oh yeah, it's so good. <laughs> and it was also one of my favorite moments of Chad. Those are the funniest moments in all of Spy Ninjas when Chad was boring. You gotta watch those. <laughs> yeah, that arc is so underrated in general. Oh yeah. Interesting time, yeah. I, I was so new at the time. I just thought Chad was boring all the time at the time. <laughs> no. I was like, oh, this is normal Chad. All right, that throw is for real. Sorry. Oh, okay. That's a four. Disgusting. We, didn't touch. we all heard Daniel's successful moments of the Spy Ninja. Or yeah. at least the moment he's proud of. Yeah, I mean, the music videos are the, the, the killer. Is there anything that you're proud of? I don't know, man. It was like weirder. I wasn't ever... Oh, yeah. It was, Sorry. I don't know. It was weirder. I wasn't ever like a part of the Spy Ninjas. And they didn't ever... I had a great highlight moment with Project Zorgo. I'll talk about that. Of course you would. You, I, I call it the laser video. Chad called it, who do I save? Oh yeah. Which was fine. With the meme thumbnail. <laughs> yeah. That was when I was on my Project Zorgo grind. That video, I set up lasers. I trapped V in a wheelchair. I, I watched it in the React video. We watched it. Yeah. That's yeah. rude. That video was one of their best performing videos ever because of my setup. So ultimately, Rude. Because because that video did well and promoted Project Zorgo very well, I got a big bonus. <laughs> big. Big Project Zorgo Busy bonus. Busy gave you some cacheroni? Yeah, dude, I pro it promoted them big time. It looked cool, there were lasers, there was fog. Hey, it did big views for the Spy Ninjas and I made some good money off of it. That's it, that's my moment. Ah, okay, yeah. That was a really great story, Dane. Now watch this Thanks. try. Hope you got enough practice in on this one. Why was six afraid of seven? Because, se wait, this that doesn't make yeah. any sense. Seven, eight, nine. Yeah. Suck in. Suck out. <laughs> oh, dang it. Well, yeah, that definitely sucked. There's a little bit on two. There's a little bit on two. There's a little bit on two. What's your most successful moment then, huh? Since you're such a bad guy on the yeah. Spy Ninjas. Thank you, Dan. Well, while Dane gets his practice reps in. I'm listening. And while Dane enjoys the popularity of his exploits. <laughs> when my most crowning achievement, my crowning achievement is one that I will always remember and cherish for all times. And it's my involvement in the end of Project Zorgo. Oh, that's tr it's true. The end video. Which, Dan said that his laser video was the best, but what is the most viewed video of all of Spy Ninja history? And also one of the longest, that was up there. That was a movie, pretty much. But I planned the entire mission from Getting the cloaker involved and for splitting the teams apart when we needed to. Yeah. And for trying to get that mission done in as efficient time as possible. Yeah, we had to be in and out. Yeah, I mean, you couldn't hang out forever uh, at the crime scene. <laughs> the crime scene. We made it a crime scene. Oh. No, I made it a crime scene, but we won't get into that. And I also edited that video, and the only meme that I remember inserting was something with, like, Snooky. <laughs> Snooky? Really? How did Snooky fit into that video? <laughs> Not really, but it was just something we were joking about one time, and that's, like, the one meme that I'm like, yes, I put that in there. I don't usually put memes in videos. Huh, I gotta rewatch that one. Yeah. I wanna rewatch re all these videos you've been talking yeah, about. Yeah, wow. We're all proud of the, some of the videos that have come out. Yeah, dude, I am proud of some of the history with the Spy Ninjas. Well, Heck, yeah. Of, let's see if you can be proud of this next throw, because this one's for the books. It's like a wench. Okay. 
Oh, dang it, there's more than me. Four. Four. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is the current scoreboard. 38, 24, 31. It can be brought back. Is 24 the lowest number, or is that? Yeah, yeah that's your score, actually. I think it is, yeah. This will be satisfying. Yes. Oh. Oh. Quattro? Whoa, yeah, that's cool. Fine. I can film myself. Why, you think it's gonna help you? Yeah. Look how tough this guy is. This guy, Look how tough he is. This guy has the lowest scoreboard, <laughs> and he's gonna try and flex on us. Fine. Stop. Don't film us. <laughs> <laughs> oh, are you sick? Look at that. It is a six. Well, oh, I don't know if it is. Wait. Oh my gosh, that's really like so close. That's Guys, so what do you close. think? Comment down below. Did I get it on six or not? You know what? I think you did. I feel like if we don't give it to Daniel, you guys at home might not be happy about that. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's true. Thanks, guys. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> yeah. that, was that was a good one. That was good. Oh. That was horrible. Three. Oh. oh. Film this one. I'll try a selfie Probably. shot. Oh, it, okay. works, guys. It, worked. it worked for Daniel. It'll probably work for me. Probably. Line it up. Line it up. Do that with plenty of stuff that Daniel was doing. No. 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 I'll do you one better, Daniel. I, have, I feel like I have to look. <laughs> it's so scary. I have to look. I have to look. Oh, oh. oh wait a minute. Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Melvin's final is at a 45. Okay, Mel Melvin obviously won, but I can still beat Dane if he gets like a one or I get like a six or something. Well, good thing that's impossible. I have to get a six. <laughs> I have to get a six for any chance. Oh! Okay. oh! I did it, I did it. It's definitely a six. Three. Oh! Whoa. That was it. It all comes down to this. Whoever loses gets the title of Wanker Boy John. Then, Load me oh. up. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody, they thought I couldn't do it. They might be right. <laughs> oh! Oh, baby! <sighs> oh. Winner. There was a winner among us. Oh. Hey! Melvin! <laughs> oh, whoa. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, get it, get it, get it. Yes, get it. Whoa. Yes, yes, right. get it. And I am Wanker Boy John. I'm so glad I got that shot. And you guys even thought I couldn't selfie it. Mm. Doesn't that all make us feel pretty successful too? Just like the stories we shared. Yeah. I, I agree. Yeah, I, agree. I feel successful. <laughs> I feel like I said that like such an NPC. Oh, yeah. Well, hey. Speaking of NPC, we're here at round one, arcade and amusement. Round one. Yes. What are we doing here, NPC? Well, Spy Ninjas HQ, as you can see from the videos, they have a whole host of arcade machines, of course. Are you serious? I'm serious. Give me tokens. Okay, yeah. Well, you, hey, Daniel lost the last game, oh. so you get the tokens. <laughs> and you, you're making more than us. Bye. Hey. The story sharing theme of this segment will be embarrassing stories. Oh. Okay, let's game. One of my most embarrassing Spy Ninjas moments. It wasn't even when I was in a video. It was Halloween. Unlike most people, I sometimes can be boring and I don't like to always dress up. It's a lot of work and I don't always have a costume in mind. That's kind of it right there. I know everybody would think that's embarrassing that I don't wear a costume all the time. Only if it's a good costume. Chad then forced me, forced me against my will. <laughs> to wear his giant yellow Kill Bill outfit. I'll pop a picture up. Oh yeah! It looked ridiculous. I was a giant yellow guy amongst all the scary Halloween individuals. <laughs> that a boy, Chad, that a boy. And I can guarantee you one thing, I did not get any girls that night. Um. I think it's because of Chad's yellow Kill Bill outfit. That's it!
You look good, bro. Your butt was popping out. It looks nice. Daniel, you match yeah. the exact yellow bunch. Oh, black <laughs> and same yellow. Shade. Black and yellow. You look like a round one spokesperson. Black and yellow, black and yellow. <laughs> now you, embarrassing. Right. Yeah, and then you stand there listening. I, and I will judge. <laughs> this is why I can't wait for HQ to open, because it's going to be way better than this. But also, I can erase the memories I have at this freaking place. Last time I was here, trying to make my girlfriend jealous. <laughs> Remember? I'm like, he was uh, Regina at the time, and then, uh, you know, Allie. Al, Al Yella. <laughs> I was sending pictures to Regina saying, look, I'm with Allie. Look at us on the hungry hippos. Look at me accidentally falling down and making it look like I... Ah, fake proposal. I saw that. Yeah, yeah. L look at me accidentally falling down and looking at, like I proposed to Allie. Oh gosh, I was acting like such a, a goose, such a ninny, such a wanker. The wanker. So I just want to erase those memories from my brain. I hate you. I hate you. Ah, uh, the you and Allie times. Fun. Your sister was hot, bro. I'm just I know, right? Yeah, <laughs> it totally is, man. Yeah, you know, earlier in the week, they told me to help them out with the video. Um, I think it was something about Daniela dating random guys and stuff. What's yeah, typical that Daniela. all about? I heard about that, yeah. Where the heck are you? Oh, are you dating two? No, 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 no. no. Oh. I'm not dating anybody. I just heard they're doing a video. Regina's like, dating a bunch of other guys. Oh. Yeah, how does that make you feel? I thought that was heinous. I don't care. I thought you would be there. Good for her. Well, anyway, she's going on a date with this, with the winner, and it's not you. Yeah. That's harsh. That's like a, I, that's some game show stuff. Like, I'm happy for her. Yeah, it's a guy that no. looks like Bad Bunny. Oh, he's cool. Does yeah. he have the similar amount of money? I'm pretty sure. <laughs> oh. Does he have like two well, long ears like him? What? What's your, uh, embarrass- um, what's Wait. yours? You didn't give an embarrassing thing. Wait, well, what was the point of Daniel's story again? Oh yeah, wait, you're trying to deflect. Yeah, You're both yeah, trying yeah. to deflect. No of that. What? That was my, that's what my embarrassing moment was here at round one. Okay. Oh, oh my fault. I hate this place. That's oh, that's that's HQ that's is better. Ooh, look at the old Mobile Day. I forget what it's called. The Mobile Command Center? Mobile. CC. The Command Center Day Mobile. Yo. Oh, look at that. That's nice. That's nice. Yeah, my truck is also very dirty because I just took it out snowboarding not too long ago. Very cool. That's Dude. good. There was an avalanche near Vegas recently. Yeah, I saw that. Can you believe that? That's crazy. I'm Mount Charleston. I was there that day. What? It's probably the aliens. Possibly. Embarrassing story. My most embarrassing moment of the spine inches <laughs> was uh Remember that one time Daniel walked up to you and kissed you on the cheek? Oh wait, that's now. <laughs> sorry. Sorry, I'm sorry. Honestly. I think we just ended the video, y'all. Peace. Subscribe. <laughs> uh, one of my most embarrassing moments of the Spy Ninjas um, was the revelation to Chad and V that uh, I invited girls over <gasps> to show off the safe house to. I was like, yo, check it out. This is where I'll be living. <laughs> Juicy. Oh my gosh. And then I made out with every single one of them <laughs> on the bean bags. And never told anybody. I think everyone's gonna want to know this, and I'm glad. Dude, this... I, I sat on those bean bags. Oh, yes. No, 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 there's makeout juice everywhere. Yeah, but then I, I told uh, Chad and V, and then that was like so embarrassing. And then, like, they never sat on those again. Oh. It's like, come on, it's just making out. Yeah, I, honestly, that would be embarrassing to embarrassing. share with Chad and V. Yeah. <laughs> like, I don't know why, I just felt so compelled to be like, hey, Chad and V, um, that's good. That's a lot. That happened. That's a lot. Always be truthful. <laughs> that concludes the arcade portion and the embarrassing stories portion of our trip to experience the Spy Ninja headquarters ahead of time. Phew, look at that. We just essentially experienced the Spy Ninja HQ. Yeah. Except their stuff is going to be like probably upgraded, right? It's going to be way better. And this is probably like 5%. Like okay. we drove around all of Las Vegas to get all of these little experiences. But now you can get them all in one place whenever Spy Ninja headquarters opens up. Wait, but I remember at the headquarters they were climbing stuff. Oh! I don't remember climbing stuff. And there's VR stuff there too. We climbed? Yeah, we already climbed, so that's okay. Okay. Um, that's why I didn't even think about it. Daniel. Did, did, uh, yeah, I got I got the Apple Vision Pro. We were battling for it, but I got it. You got it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we can kind of experience VR. It won't be as cool as the HQ one, but... Daniel doesn't go rock climbing though. And it stopped raining, so why don't we just take him outdoors for a real climbing session? No, 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 no. Wait, Daniel. 
through. Yeah. One last HQ experience. No, yeah. No, wasn't and there an avalanche? Just... But we're gonna film it right now. No, Come on, Dan. Yeah. We'll car. post it. We'll post it in the car. I need to upload more. If I'm dead, I can't upload. Real outdoor on the mountain, climbing a thousand feet, a million feet. No, no, no. We're going to Red Rock. We're going to Red Rock. You have a rope tied to you. Dude, are we are we going to Red Rock? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs>